Magandang araw mga chong! Welcome to Monkey's Bananas Vlogs where we unbox anything and everything under the sun. Today we're going to unbox as promised yung Hot Toy Star Wars line natin. Uh, medyo napaparamin sila and medyo malaki na rin yung ating na-invest dun sa mga figures na binibili natin. So, nag-start ako actually sa uh, Sith lang ng mga uh, side show before. But since Hot Toys really uh, pushing the limit dun sa ganda ng details as well as kung paano nila in-interpret into 1 is to 6 figures yung Star Wars line. So, it's definitely a must-have. So, nagkuha natin to sa sale from Field Wars and with the help of uh, Sir Oli again. Thank you and shout out again to you and Sir John. So, we're collecting more and more hot toys now. Um, the Star Wars line specifically yung Sith lang. But, Hopefully, as well as the Mandalorian. So, we are going to look forward to unboxing more of them. So, this one is going to be the two-pack Stormtrooper MMSS-268. And uh, I think there's no need to open both dito sa ating unboxing video. I'll just open one because technically they're the same. I'll just unbox the other one in silent. But we're just going to focus on siguro dito muna since this is the... One that is have a uh, damaged plastic, but let's bring it near. So, it's time to unbox. There's not much uh, fuss about going through a stormtrooper. You know they're very bad at aiming. So typical Star Wars Star Wars box um, creators as well as young designers. Secret base, Hong Kong, Star Wars two pack. So it's more or less like a shoebox as well. And inside you will see the details and the sleeve. So once we pull this out, clamshell is going to show. Here we go. Awesome. Awesome. So I haven't disposed any of the hot toys because we've done the storage. And it's going to be easier for us to um, store them without having to let them go. But definitely for Marvel Legends, we don't have to do so mainly because hindi naman siya ganun ka ganda yung quality but more or less this set of action figures are great let's just remove it from the clamshell or remove it from the box now let's just remove the clamshell I'm looking to army build some troopers mainly because of Mandalorian, um, si Chiru, then, and para merong kalaban and stand along with um, Darth Vader. Yep. So let's focus more on the base first. So base typical, um, yung this and the stand. So both of them are the same. Just pull it out later. And here are the two stormtroopers. So yun, ito yung stormtroopers natin out of the box. Uh, as you can see, there's a height difference between the two. Uh, siguro half an inch lang yung height difference nila. Pero more or less, ito yung accessories that comes with the two-pack stormtroopers. Um, Field Bars always has sales of uh, Star Wars, so if you're on the budget and you really think that the figures definitely these two are worth it for the price of one so it's going to be a great buy specifically pag on sale sila so if you guys especially yung first um i mean yung uh trilogy uh sequel trilogy from the original uh, perhaps you guys can Look up the prices that they had before the sale and definitely sulit na sulit if you're a Hot Toy Star Wars Collectors fan. So for me, original trilogy and siguro yung uh, Sith Lords uh, with Dooku on the prequel, siguro sila Kylo if ever magmura in the future. But hopefully, uh, will do. But for the Clone Wars, I don't want to start with that. Just yung normal lang yung uh, nag spark ng nostalgia. But here are the accessories, extra pegs for I think for the hands, uh, for the figures, and uh, ilang sets to. 
five sets of extra pair of hands, yung kanilang fanny pack sa likod, and a bunch of guns, blasters, and rifles. So, for the two. And, um, yun, yung kanilang base, iisa lang naman ng style niya, so I only pulled out one. And let's check out the articulation and details of these figures. So, let's just go with the shorter one. Pero medyo muscular yung build nito, unlike from the one that's taller. So, definitely there are variances on the Stormtroopers. So, God, I bought two. Hopefully, I'm not gonna buy three, because it's really gonna be more expensive. That's already Hot Toys quality. Uh, for the both of them. Meron sila mga plastic sheets earlier kaya ako siya tinanggal at nilabas ko muna dun sa box before natin siyang ilabas dito and display for the clamshell. So it's a typical Stormtrooper original trilogy and then yung uh, sequels, yung tatlo. Velcro type dun sa belt. And uh, I'm not sure if yung ilaw ko lang yung medyo yellowish pero it's not that bad. You really can't get any perfect ones but this one really looks nice. Um, matte and the uh, wala siyang actually matte finish but yung pagka pearly white skin niya or yung armor is glossy and yung plastic sleeves is especially yung sa mga nagkakross yung uh, bodysuit nila para hindi siguro magasgasan if ever they're gonna move around the package so the blasters will sit right on the holsters and then you can put in the fanny pack at the back but it's a typical um, hot toys body slim body and um, yung liquid niya is normal tela and garterized panel. So, you can rotate the hands, not that much because of the uh, shirt or yung body suits nila. Um, articulation, I think double jointed though. So, definitely articulation is good, but you're just gonna make them hold the hand or in action poses. So, helmet is pegged, and I think that's it. Articulation more or less typical Hot Toys figure, but the details on these are definitely a must-have. So this will go well with Vader, with the Mandalorian that I will unbox, and with the Rogue One figures, which I think I believe for me is one of the best ones to date, if not second to the first trilogy. Um, it's actually fourth, basically. But these are the unboxing of the Hot Toy Stormtroopers. I'm not going to go get into much details because you guys already know. There's a bunch of um, videos already out there. But thank you again for watching uh, Monkey's Bananas Vlogs. And we'll have more of them soon in our channel. So always take care, stay safe, and good shit lang. Peace out.